Gift of Life has helped save many lives through marrow and stem cell donations. Now the nonprofit will be able to help even more people right here in South Florida. WPTV News Channel 5's Chris Gilmore takes you to the grand opening of the Gift of Life Center for Cell and Gene Therapy in Boca Raton. Yay. A ribbon cutting for a center that's all about saving lives. Gift of Life founder and CEO Jay Feinberg describes his nonprofit as a marrow registry aimed at curing blood cancer through cellular therapy. Create these new living drugs that will be given back to patients to help cure them of their diseases. His work just got easier with the new Center for Cell and Gene Therapy in Boca Raton acting as a biobank. By storing those cells in advance, we can actually have them ready on demand or off the shelf for patients who need transplants very quickly. The new center will provide transplant physicians, researchers, as well as cell and gene therapy developers with the donor cell products they need to help patients you know, find customized cures. Everything happens for a reason. So, and, and something as, as, as big as this for sure. From people like Michael Danziger, who traveled all the way from New Jersey to Boca to make his stem cell donation. Ten years ago, he also donated cheek cells. It was an amazing feeling to know that, you know, just the blood coursing through our veins, the, you know, things that we take for granted is literally life-saving for somebody else. It was, an, it, was, uh, it was like an inspiring feeling. The work done at the center caught the attention of city leaders like Mayor Scott Singer, who knows firsthand the important work going on in the facility. Mother-in-law Eleanor's life was saved through a transplant match that was facilitated by Gift of Life. A step forward in science and for a gift that keeps on giving. In Boca Raton, Chris Gilmore, WPTV News Channel 5.